I'm Lucy Bullivant. I'm a cultural historian and architectural exhibition curator. I'm the editor-in-chief of urbanista.org, which is my own web scene founded in 2012, specializing in urban design and planning globally. And I'm also the professor of urban design history and theory for Syracuse in London. I grew up in an architectural family. My mum is a landscape architect, worked at the Department of the Environment. And my dad, also an architect, was a pioneer in creative use of information technology in the construction industry. And, but it was only really in my mid-twenties that I started actually meeting architects. And I worked in the art world, so I was meeting artists. But then, little by little, I started meeting my peers who were trained architects. And so figures like Alison Brooks, Alessandra Cianchetta, Irina Bauman, Joanna Gibbons, Liza Fior, Catherine Clark, and others of that generation have, for the first time, I think, they have shifted the ground and, and they're moving the paradigm of what is a really, really solid and resilient practice of urban design. So let me introduce the exhibition, Urbanistas, Women Innovators in Architecture, Urban and Landscape Design. It brings together the work of five highly experienced and seasoned practitioners who've been working in the field for between 20 and 30 years. And what they all have in common is that they run their own practice. Alison Brooks runs ABA, Irina Bauman runs Bauman Lyons, Liza Fior and Catherine Clark run Muff Architecture and Art, Joanna Gibbons is the founder with her former partner JNL Gibbons, Alessandra Cianchetta is a collaborator with two other partners of AWP. The capacity that architects and urban designers need today is to be able to work at the macro and the micro scale, but also to, to understand the synergies and actually create new synergies between the, 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 the different scales. The old image of the master planner, one solitary male figure playing like God, putting his hand down through the clouds and just uh, rearranging the city like piece, pieces of furniture. That is not going to work. We're in the second day, decade of the 21st century now. And we have citizen power, which is growing through the, the, the use of the internet, open society, wiki culture, open source. We now have the tools and the mentalities to um, intervene into the future character and shape of cities.